want. In spite of being one of the few white employees at work, and therefore being treated with a certain privilege, Elizabeth hates her job. In fact, she often leaves work early, escaping to wander around bookstores or read in cafes. She gets lost in her thoughts. Wondering how her life turned out this way, she frequently considers asking her wealthy parents for money. She tried that once before, though they refused, as they knew Elizabeth would never pay it back. She also imagines contacting her former friend Sasha. Elizabeth abandoned Sasha's friendship a few years ago, but she's finally grasping how badly she wants it back. She feels like Sasha would understand her problems, and help her figure out what to do. Unfortunately, when Elizabeth does reach out. She learns that Sasha has her own problems to fix. Elizabeth doesn't know what to do. Aside from one last credit card, she's basically penniless and lacking friendship and meaning to her life. The books she loves aren't helping. In fact. Her dream to live a life of literature appears to be destroying everything she's ever hoped for.